just see that man trying to battle that wind? Yeah, that's crazy. That is cra he looks like he's in a wind tunnel. Yeah, the Pacific uh, has been very active this year. There's yes. one typhoon after another hitting the Philippines, right. Japan, mainland China. So they've really been getting hit hard. We had our own Atlanta hurricane season, mm -hmm. of course, which wraps up here in the end of November with Matthew. So a lot of things going on in the weather world there today. There is. A lot of things going on locally today, too, with Tell weather. So yeah, yeah, let's take a look outside right now on your Saturday morning. Good morning to everybody out there. In your 6 a.m. hour, it's 52 degrees across the metropolitan area in Portland. Just a few cars out there. Here's a time lapse from yesterday and going overnight up at Mount Hood Meadows. A little bit of snow on the camera lens there. I get excited when I see snow. I think a lot of you guys do too as well. I think we're looking for a good snow season up on the mountain. Current temperatures across the northwest in your 6 a.m. hour, mostly in the 40s to near 50 up and down the I-5 corridor. Albany or the cool spot at 44. Temperatures mostly in the 40s along the coastline. If you're going out, your hourly planner this morning, 8 a.m., morning fog. That gives way to just mostly cloudy skies in the afternoon. Temperatures warming up into the lower 60s. A good day to get outside, rake those leaves. Rainfall total since midnight, not a whole lot, just one one hundredth of an inch here at the Portland International Airport. But October rain stats, take a look at some of these. Our top five wettest Octobers on record at the Portland International Airport. Now, these go back to about 1940 or so. The wettest year, 1994. Some of you may remember, we got about five inches of rain just in the last three days of October that year. So that was a very wet year. And then 1947, we have 1950. And right now, we can add one more one hundredth of an inch to that. We actually have 6.83 inches at the airport as of the 6 a.m. hour. I think by the end of the month, Eileen will probably be somewhere up around uh, second place. Uh, it'll be close, but I don't think we're going to edge out the wettest year on record, but we'll keep posted on that. Quick look at your satellite and radar loop this morning. Not a whole lot going on. No showers, just a few scattered showers actually up in the uh, Cascades. And there's our next system. That's winding up and it's going to move towards Vancouver Island uh, later this evening and that'll bring a return to rain again on your Sunday. Our rainfall forecast shows just a few hundredths of an inch. We might get another quarter of an inch to a third of an inch in Portland. Most of that will be coming overnight tonight and then into your Sunday as that next system pushes in. Quick look at that forecast on the coast on your Saturday. Morning fog and clouds, then a mostly cloudy afternoon, just a light south wind, 15 to 25 miles per hour. Temperatures mostly in the mid-60s. In the valley, AM fog and clouds, followed by a mostly cloudy afternoon. McMinnville, you'll top out at 63. On the east side of the state, mostly cloudy, just a shower risk over there. Winds west, 15 miles per hour. Madras, 63. And Bend, you'll top out at 60. In the gorge, AM fog and low clouds, and then just a mostly cloudy afternoon. Kind of a carbon copy across the state. Cascade Lock, 65. Government Camp, you're the cool spot at 51. There's that seven day forecast, Eileen. Today, mostly cloudy. Good day to get outside, 62 degrees. Then that next system returns tomorrow, rain at times, 58. And then we keep it right in that rain continuing on Monday, Tuesday, showers, back to rain Wednesday, mm -hmm. temperatures mostly in the upper 50s to near 60, which is about seasonal norms. And mm -hmm. don't forget to download the PDX weather app. You'll get live weather 24 7 with custom forecast. It's a great thing. I've got it on my phone, available for uh, Android and uh, iPhone. Look at it all the time. Yep. Religiously. Like yep. Uh, if you do plan on going outside today, today is the day yeah. this today, weekend. Good day to get outside. Not a lot of rain. Uh, later tonight is when we see that next system come in. So get outside and rake all those leaves. <laughs> all I kind of right. like doing that. It's, it's, it's <laughs> therapeutic. Do like raking those. I'm a high energy kind of guy. <laughs> okay. Can you tell? Yes. Steve, thank you very <laughs> you much. You bet. Thanks. Okay, the time is now 7.30.